Right, hello. This is a... I knew that'd happen. This is a plant haul from earlier on today. I went to Urban Jungle and stopped off at Botonico. On the way back, they're both pretty close to each other between Beckles and Bungie. A lot of people may have, uh, this is uh, mainly an on online shop, I believe, uh, Botonico123. Um, but they've got a little outlet in a uh, Barnaby Garden Centre. They've got a little area there with a polytunnel. They do some plants. So anyway, we got this uh, Colocasia Black Magic. I want to get another one anyway, and I'd already picked one up that I like the look of, and uh, this one caught my eye. So it's a little bit windy, but so you've got more or less a classic black magic leaf there, with a little bit of green still in the corner. Maybe a genetic mutation, but looking at the next leaf. Look at that, they come out green normally and then fade to the sort of really dark red burgundy stroke black. But this one, it's only got a few specks, it looks like a mojito colocation, so it's got a sort of speckled effect on it. So that's a bit different, so I thought I'd have that for $8.99. And also it has got a little tiny, if that's going to focus, a little tiny baby coming out the, the base. Whenever I'm buying color cages I always look for, well I look for one for a good couple of leaves and obviously as a new leaf starting to come out we also look at the base, make sure it's got some growth around it and it has got a baby in that one. So let's have a look at this one, it just fell over. So, get this dead leaf out of the way. Colocasia fontanzii. So this one's got like a dark burgundy stem. With nice uh, dark midrib leaves, the veins. So it's got a couple of good leaves on that. And obviously it's got a, a decent sized pup coming out the side as well. So I'm going to lay that down before it gets blown over again. So yeah, they're both uh, $8.99 each. Good, decent sized plants. They'll uh, go in a display somewhere for the last month or so of summer before I Try and overwinter them. In fact, interestingly, if you look at the back of this black magic, you can see from the front it's only a little bit of green, but at the back, quite a lot. So that's an interesting variation. So, what did I get from Urban Jungle? I had to lay this one down as well because the, it's a bit top heavy. So we've got an aloe arborescence, decent size, decent size plant, as you can see, and loads and loads of new growth around the, the base. This is probably not going to be hardy, so they'll have to come into the greenhouse or conservatory over winter. The information there if you want to pause and read and I happened to drop into B&M in Beckles while I was passing a lot of their summer stuff was uh, reduced I've got this long pot here for a pound not the, the most expensive looking pot but that'll come in handy for something that's uh, like two foot tall, 
plastic. But I can do something with that. Right, so I'll get back to repotting these. See if I can get a bit more growth out of them before summer ends. Right, thanks for watching.